this is for all my tall people. So if you're taller, you want to look more filled out. You know, let's say you're six, six one, six two, six three, six five. You know, anything in your sixes, you want to look more filled out. So shoulders just helps you look more full. The more reps you do, <laughs> the heavier it feels. Fuck. Let's do it. Shoulders is not a difficult thing to work. Um, there's only three muscles really in the shoulder. You got your front delt, you got your um, your rear delt behind, and then you got your side delt. As you can see, you can see it through my through my jacket. Rear delt, side delt, front delt. I rather have big shoulders than big arms. As stupid as that sounds, but shoulders make a difference. I'm telling you, especially if you're taller as well. I'm a tall person. I'm 6'3", so big shoulders, big legs, just makes you look like Superman. So 15 pound dumbbells to 30 pound dumbbells is what I'm doing. For some people, 15 pounds is their max. So start with five, start with 10 and work your way up. I'm gonna start with lateral raises. If you guys see me at your gym and I'm wearing a hoodie, that usually indicates I don't want to be fucked with. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. Really, that means I'm focused. But if y'all see me at your gyms or whatever, holla at me. It's all love. When, when, usually when you see people in hoodies, though, it's like, yo, don't fuck with me. Like, let me fucking work out. You know, some people don't understand that. Like, so, some of y'all just gotta read the room. A lot of y'all niggas don't read the room. It's like, bro, if I have my fucking hoodie on, possibly I don't want to be talked to. Like, you have to read their energy. You know, then there's those guys that just be like, fuck it, I'm gonna well, well, talk to you anyways. It's like, no, dude. Respect people in the gym. Don't fucking come up to people when they're focused and killing it and sweating and like just killing their workout, like read the room. to do for shoulders is really just fucking annihilate my my side delts most people don't understand like when you do chest when you're working your chest you're also working your front delt so I work a lot of my front delt most of the time so on shoulder day I might do a little press but I'm not just gonna fucking destroy my front delts because they're already super big. Look, they're big. They're almost, they're almost bigger than my chest. And so I got to balance it out, hit more real delts, hit more side delts. I don't think you can never have enough side delt um, where your delts come out. I don't think you can never have enough of that. That's, that's the best part of the delt that you want as far as just being big, right? Of course you want good front uh, front delts, but the side delts is where it's at. But as far as front delts, I might do one or two exercises with my front delts because I do so much front delt on chest day. And I try to only focus on, as you can see my upper chest, I like to focus on incline. So I'm going like this most of the time, which is also working a bunch of my, my front delt. But 
I'm gonna do one more set, 15 pounds, and I'm gonna go up in weight. And then it's getting hot in here. I'll probably take this jacket off in a bit. One, two. So I'm doing about three, four, 20 to 30 reps. Mm. Mm. And that's my range for delts. So for delts, it's different than any other body part. I go heavy with high reps, you know? And if I feel like my delts are sore, I'll just lower the intensity. That's it. Mm. 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 And the goal is to have the dumbbells come above my ears. Uh, right there. Uh, 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 fuck. Uh. Somebody at this gym stole the fucking 20 pound dumbbell. So I'm gonna jump to 25 and then I'm gonna jump to 30. I would jump to 20, um, but I can't do that because somebody stole the fucking weights at the fucking gym. Ugh. Play a little music. Yo, I need some good songs. Like, I mean, I do have good songs, but I don't know. Hit me with a playlist. Hit me with a rapper. Who the hell should I listen to? I'm not really into rap. Like, I listen to rap, but I don't know. So much negative shit behind rap. I don't... <laughs> the only time I listen to it, honestly, is when I'm in the gym. But I need some good music. Let me know. You know what I'm listening to? You know what I'm going to listen to right now? That always gets me hype. This is old school. This is way past my time, but... Let me show you. I'm listening to the dog. The dog! Yeah! <laughs> Just did two sets of the 25 pounds, um, 20 to 30 reps. Uh, now I'm gonna do 30 pound dumbbells, doing it for about three sets. Gotta keep that intensity, guys. All right, so shoulders is not hard. Doing shoulders is very simple, but it's not easy. <laughs> mm. Shoulders are looking kind of capped now after all them sets. Pretty good. some better traps I mean my traps are all right they hang for sure you know um, but to be honestly I don't want super super big traps because it just makes me look too much like a bodybuilder <laughs> don't get me wrong like love looking like a bodybuilder but I want that more aesthetic gentleman look right so very athletic can be easily mistaken as a bodybuilder but not a bodybuilder, you know? This is for all my tall people. So if you're taller, you wanna look more filled out. You know, let's say you're six, six one, six two, six three, six five. You know, anything in your sixes, you wanna look more filled out. So shoulders just helps you look more full. The more reps you do, <laughs> the heavier it feels. Fuck, let's do it. <clears throat> <clears throat> And when I do get lazy, I don't stop, I rest. So I rest, hit it again, make sure I'm getting my 20 to 30 reps in. Oh, fuck. Oh, man, those last.
last one's got sloppy. But you gotta, you gotta do what you can. But rear delts is not hard. Um, there's only so many workouts you can do to hit rear delts. And the one I'm doing is just bent over, dumbbell rear delts. Nothing too crazy, but that is what I'm doing. So it's best that you're just sitting down. Oh. Oh, fuck, man. Oh. 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 So I'm doing about 15 to 20 reps. 15 to 20 reps for red delts. Um, like I said, guys, it's simple, but not easy. So all these workouts, you know, they're simple to do, but not easy. And if you guys don't have dumbbells, use pillows, like take your pillow up and down with your pillow, throw some, throw some books in there, you know, hopefully try to get it the same weight if you're doing two pillows at a time, but alternate if you're doing but one pillow. So take the pillow, pretend like this dumbbell's a pillow, put weights in there, <clears throat> go up and down, uh, uh, just like that. Switch hands if you need to, uh, and really kill it. Uh, uh. It should be no fucking excuses. 15 reps, 15, 15, 20, baby. Let's go. Oh, fuck. Oh, man. Oh. All right, so I wanted to save front delts for last um, because like I said, I would like you guys to focus on your laterals, these ones, and of course your rear delts. That's what's gonna give you massive shoulders. For me, I'm doing a little bit of front delts and uh, I'm just gonna do 15 to 20 reps, two sets, nothing too crazy. Cause like I said, my front delt overpowers my side and my rear. So I'm not gonna do too much, but if you're lacking any of these body parts, hit it more, hit one more than the other. That's how you make that body part catch up. And that goes for anything, not just your delts, your shoulders, your biceps, your legs, all the things. So I'm gonna do five. reps and now as you guys can see i'm not like throwing it up this is all shoulders i'm doing all shoulders we want to stay as stable as possible as still as possible anybody that's doing this and rocking back and forth and shit you're not doing it right or the weight is too heavy go lighter so do some weight you can handle control the weight do not let the weight control you. So these are three simple shoulder workouts you can do. Now I do a lot more for my shoulder workouts, but this is just three simple things to get in and out. If I'm short on time and I know it's shoulder day, I'm not gonna fucking miss it. I'm gonna fucking hit it, right? <laughs> and I'm gonna hit it the best I can do. And I know these workouts work. So there's no excuses. If you're not going to the gym, do push-ups. do anything, right? That's how you guys get the body you want. You guys gotta stay consistent. Um, so, about to do some cardio, and what I'm doing for cardio is simple. See that right there? That's called the elliptical. 30 minutes of cardio. See that right there? Treadmill, 30 minutes of cardio, incline. No excuses. It's simple, but not easy. It's your boy, A.B. Anthony Brown. I'm out.